and uh, I wish I looked like him when he was I was skinny at 17 he's he's, he's my size already and it's like he kind of motivates me to keep working out to you know I can't have him surpass me be stronger than me but I think it's gonna happen soon so he definitely has a better ceiling than I, than I ever had. Pull up the schedule what we're doing today. Nice little 25 30 minute workout. Um, guys, tip write everything down because if you think about it, your thoughts are everywhere. If you write it down, thoughts are one place. But uh, we're gonna do some bands, some ITCs, which is simple weights, uh, landmines, uh, shoulder raise, side raise, some slams, some abs. We're gonna go do some catch and stuff. Watch this guy throw like 95 from across the diamond. What do you work on when you're in the gym during the off season? My body. Mm. Yeah. What about it? Just my body. Finish working out, do some catching stuff, some fielding. Then we got hit. We're gonna call it a day, get some interviews going. And um yeah. It's basically just like loading to create space for that ball. So when you're hitting, you, when the pitch is coming like this, you're loading, right? So it's kind of the same thing with the, the glove, with receiving a ball. So old school, it's pretty much like this. I show sign, I really don't do anything with my glove, right? So what's gonna happen, now I'm gonna have to go get balls like this, right? And let this now in the middle. So now it's evolved to coming here, going to that ball, to more recent, tapping and going and then now everyone knows this is the trick i'm showing side whatever it is i'm coming here and glove load you kind of want to sweep to get that ball so this is what i call creating space so this is my glove load and when i'm going back i'm creating space to get any ball wherever it is All right so if i'm here if i'm not i'm just doing this right here which a lot of people do do then it comes harder to get those low balls outside, inside, especially inside, if you're right, because you gotta come around that ball. It's easier to get this ball. So now if I'm here, and I'm getting, I'm getting low as I can, this is almost like I'm waiting for the ball. So I'm coming there. So now, when I'm here, when I sweep, now if I'm waiting the ball, if I'm waiting for the ball correctly, now I can get any pitch I want. Come here, if I see the ball's coming inside, I can go soup, work around it. If I see the ball coming outside, I can go soup, work around it. And if it's low, just wait for it. I can go here, I can present it like that's the umpire, or if it's if you kind of got caught up, you just bring it up like that. So people would think that I wouldn't be able to get to the high pitch, but you'll be more surprised because you're coming here and you just go shoot. Simple, it's fast. I frame a lot of high pitches like that. I don't even think you need to have a strong arm to do this. Me, I throw 80, 81. I know it's considered pretty fast, but two years ago when I was throwing 74 from behind the plate, it was still working for me. So. A lot of catchers like to come and take ground. So this is what we're throwing down in a second. They like to come here and come at the ball so they can have a lot more like speed in the arm. But then what that does is you're gonna take ground and then when you come, you're landing here. So when your front foot is in front of your back foot, now your, hip is, your hips are locked. So when you come, you're gonna go and your balls are gonna tail. I mean, if you're good enough, athletic enough to land like this, I mean, you could do that, whatever you want. But what works for me 
is I just like to do like a jab step, right? So it's kind of just like a, a flick. So I'm here and I want to replace my back leg with my front leg. So I'm here, kind of just quick, super quick. Super quick right here. Shoop. As you can see in the video that Ryan's gonna put right now. And then, um, so I'm not going to take a round. I'm just waiting for that ball to get me, let it get deep. I'm just going super. Last year I threw out about like 16 or 15 people out of 24 and it worked for me. And I'm super accurate so I don't gotta worry about any of that. So um, another thing that I like is I don't like to sway this way because when I sway this way then my foot is gonna drag and I'm gonna land here and all my throws are gonna tail up or away or whatever it is. So I kind of wait for the ball. I kind of go towards the ball a little bit but I make sure I keep my back leg back. So I'm here and I'm landing. I'm gonna mobile position to throw. That's what works for me. That's, that's a good drill for that. But you don't know how to extend through the ball. You stay through the ball. A lot of times you get that off speed pitch or you get to change it or whatever and you feel like you got it front but you learn how to how to how to get the ball out of time. You keep going, 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 going through, 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 and you go through it, you know what I'm saying? So you're not you're not coming here, you're coming, coming, coming through and then you just roll over them. Especially change ups, off speed. A lot of times you're gonna be where you're gonna be out in front on off speed, right? So if you learn if you try to keep this ball this seems like way out in front, but if you learn how to keep that ball middle, then it teaches you how to stay through 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 the ball. As a drill, you know what I mean? That was a little hookish, right? You feel like you're a little out in front, right? But the way you're staying through the ball is, is amazing. Should I teach you extension and how to stay through the ball? Come here. Raise a strong kid, but look. You see where that ball went? Was out and down and away, but, right? but he was able to stay through it, stay through it, stay through it. Me and Danny, we're gonna do a swing off. You wanna do uh, just to 10 or 15? 15? All right, so 15 barrels, and um, whoever gets there first, the other person gets redemption. And once they tie it up, then the other person goes, then you swing off like that. So if you foul ball or strike that you take, whatever, it's the next person, it's a swing off, all right? Let's do it. Go ahead. Yeah. Oh, oh. Danny got advantage because dad's been throwing him his whole life. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta go with the house. Hitters hit, man. Hitters hit. Hitters hit. Don't worry about it. But he got his dad. He's been facing his dad his whole life. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Something. You, guys, you be the judge of you. Nah. How's one, too? Yeah. That one was like a little soft liner. So yeah. Heat. I'll give it a heat. Drop. I like that one in the air, brother. Right here, hold my I told you. <laughs> I'm, I'm telling you, bro. He got nothing on me, man. He does. He got his dad throwing. He got a lot of him. That was a foul ball. All right, I got it. Oh, is, yeah. It's not, that's it, that's it's not the camera, man. <laughs> oh, no. Then he got 17 years facing his dad. <laughs> Oh, uh, what's that? 3-1? I'll give you that. 3-2. 3-2, 3-2. 3-3. 4-1 on the center. Uh, what was that? Uh, no, I'll give it out there. That's because it's pop-up. That's a close. I don't know. Get to get it. What is that? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like there's an open in. So get the head out. Hey right. man, hey man. Try this up. Oh Ooh. my god. My money's on daddy. Yeah, root for your brother, bro. Oh. Bro, I'm, I go for that. I'm smart. I'm a smart better. But it's not like you're betting money. I'm not. But if I was. Damn. He's up? Yeah. 
Six. Oh. Sure. oh, you end up minus two hundred. <laughs> six four. Can't let the freshie beat me. Oh, that's crazy. Oh. I'll say hard, bro. Grandma. Oh, I don't like that. You see? Can't talk. Oh, he's going a little way now. Man, I back up my talk. Ah, yeah. you see? Oh, that's good. Six five. five. Daddy got the lead. Minus 120. Seven. Oh, minus 200. Minus 260. Oh, Steve. I'm about to jump in here and beat all the uh, comeback. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Oh, Should have never swung at that one. <laughs> I mean, that might have been a dumb, dumb piece. Hey, hey. I thought he was going to swing off, not... Oh, uh, you, you see he's getting, he's getting quieter to try to avoid more contact. 9-8. 9-8. 8-8 or 9-8 more contact. Nah, man. Swing off! You want to swing? Let's do it. Swing off. Home run swing. Let's do it. Wait, 9-8? 9-8? And hitting the ball hard. All right, let's do it. Get your A swing off. <laughs> no, oh, he got caught. Damn. That was that was that was way fast. <laughs> was that, that nine was, nine? That's a swing. Nine nine. That's how you swing. Damn, two or something. Oh shit. Ten. That's a fly Ooh. ball, man. That's out in Bronx just though. Probably with you right. Me. Yeah. Ten ten. Money's a big game. Yeah. What was that? That was it? Yeah. That was it. I always hit hard. Don't, don't oh. ask him. You know it's out if you ask him. You know it's out if you ask him. That was hit hard up the middle. <gasps> oh. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Yo. You saw that? 12-9. Where are you going? Jesus. Same oh, pitch. No, man. You better make it closer because this is looking like you know he's out of reach. 12-10. 12-9. 12-9. No. <laughs> See, you're yeah, trying to sneak in that extra point. 12-9. Oh, no, you had 10. Uh, 10, it was 10-9. Oh, okay, he's 12-9. Right, he's right, he's right. Come on, no mustache. What's up, critic? Mm. Mm. Okay, okay. Alright, 12-12. 12-13. You won't go too much. Shut up. Ah, yeah. oh, you should have swayed. Don't choke. 12-14. Ooh, you got, you got redemption. You got redemption. You got, yo, let's go, Danny. You gotta, you gotta go th four in a row, basically. Row. But if you go four in a row, then I got my swing. All let's right. go, Danny. Yeah, then we go three, three. And you tie it up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a game. I get it, Tim. Yeah, he's I get it, Tim. 14. Come on, baby. Slock it right here. <laughs> I would take it to Alan. Take my fish. Yeah, it's a tight game. All right, three swings. There's three swings each. Three go. swings. Go, so no, you go. go. Right, okay, okay. Is the freshman gonna beat the junior? We'll find out here next on Youth Prospect. Three swings, right? Three swings. Do or die. Three swings. Let's go, Sad. One, one. Oh, he's on the three for three. <laughs> Ooh, come on, man. Yo. Hey, you did it on purpose, guys. It's suck. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, that's you. That was your fault. You changed it too. Two or three to win it, two to tie. Come on, man. You got this. You got the pain here. It's about right. Ooh. Two more, two more, two more, two more. But these two have to be hits. <laughs> oh my. Ah! Give me that, give me that, give me that. Excuse me, sir, can you come here for the post game interview, please? Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh man. How do you feel um, losing to uh, um, your best friend? Oh wow. It, it hurts, man. It hurts. It hurts? Yeah. You want a hug? No, no, you lost. <laughs> 
pick it up. You, you got the big dog on six wings? I'm gonna take a couple of missing out. Right, take take it back. Oh, if I get one, I'm I'm just better than both of you. But if I don't, I'm still better than both of you. <laughs> Oh, no, I'm out of here. <laughs> I'm out of here. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>